what would be your recommendation to, um, and your advice to younger doctors and physicians? Well, um, with regards to HPV, the most important thing is I would stress the importance of HPV vaccination. I ask people if they've been vaccinated, ask older people, their kids have been vaccinated. So I think that's the, you know, really the most important thing that we can do. Um, I, I mentioned before a little bit about primary HPV screening, and I think that, that that's actually going to be the way of the future. So I make sure that people are using HPV testing properly. Um, smoking cessation should be a big part of any discussion here. And really importantly, um, no news is not good news in, in the world of, of cervical cancer screening. Mm -hmm. So people assume if they don't hear anything that everything's fine, but really that the, I think it's really, uh, the doctor needs to tell the patient that you need to get the, your results and the patient needs to know that if they don't hear in two weeks or something, they should call. So it, that, that you can't just get a pap smear and not follow up on it, or you can't just do a pap smear for a patient and not follow up on it. So the follow-up is really, really key. Yeah. 